Hello, everyone. Jeff Cote with BoatingTechTalk.com. We have a question from a fellow boater. Uh, this boater is named Chris. And Chris is starting off with basically a why question. Chris has heard certainly ourselves here and other boaters advocate the concept of terminal strips and terminal strips before the panel. So when you're actually wiring a boat and you have a bunch of appliances, it doesn't matter if it's five or on my boat, it's like, I don't know, 50, 75, because I have a lot of electrical stuff on my boat. It doesn't matter if it's five or 10 or a hundred, you know, some big boats have 200 uh, electrical appliances. Why would someone put terminal strips in between the panel and the load? Why put terminal strips in the in between the two? Why not go directly from the load directly to the switches or the panel? Chris, I love the question. There is a why. Now, you might not agree with it because, you know, our boat, our ways, right? Nothing wrong with that. So here's, let me tell you why I did, and by the way, I have a Catalina 36 sailboat, and the reason why I installed terminal strips on my boat. First of all, I was inspired by larger boats that had them. And what I noticed uh, was that the wiring loom from the panel to the terminal strip was all pre-done, perfect, never touched. The biggest challenge with panels is as people add in more and more circuits, they're tempted to cut corners. I've seen uh, electrical panels that you can't even open them. Literally, the person who did the connection had probably the tiniest hands. Maybe they asked their child to do the termination and the panel could open just enough that you could see what you were doing, but barely more. I've seen other electrical panels that instead of dropping all the way down, they drop at this angle, this angle, this angle. Or when they do drop down, the wires come from all different angles and it looks like the end of the world. It looks like Someone that did this was blind and didn't care. And that generally is a previous owner or even ourselves, you know, and we're under pressure. We're trying to get a circuit in and we say, you know what? We'll make it pretty next time. And next time never comes because you know what? Life happens. We're busy. There's so many things going on. So knowing that we're not always the best at maintaining our own boats, What's better than having the terminations come to the panel and having the panel becoming this jumble of wires is to actually pre-wire every single panel switch with a wire loom to a terminal strip. And then you bring all your loads to the terminal strips. The good news about that is the terminal strips are a good point to actually test voltage. You can test voltage everywhere. And it keeps the whole panel installation perfect. When we are given the opportunity, and thank you for all of you who have invited us on your boats, to redo a wire uh, panel or a DC panel or AC panel, I am a huge advocate of terminal strips. I mean, huge. It would take a really, it'd be really hard to convince me otherwise, because it's great for troubleshooting. It's great for cleanliness. And when you look at that panel, it looks awesome. Because there's something to be said about organization. Structure, order is beautiful because it's not, it's not easy. It takes time. And when you have something that's all neat and elegant, it inspires confidence. And when it's time to troubleshoot, you look at the panel, you'll see if a connection came out or undone instantly if everything is perfectly done and well labeled. And every time you want to add a circuit, instead of having to wire the circuit all the way to the panel and having to undo that loom and worry about how you're going to make this as beautiful as it came, you just bring those new wires to the terminal strips and that connection from the terminal strip to the panel is all done. So that's the reason why, Chris, I would recommend that you consider terminal strips. But some of us, you know, maybe it's another step too far and yes, it's another connection, but it won't hurt. It won't hurt in my opinion. So thanks for asking. And if some of you have experience with terminal strips or wanna add your two cents to this conversation, please post your comments down below. Sharing is caring. So, uh, and that's how we learn. It makes our boat better. So thank you for watching everyone. I appreciate it. Thank you for watching this PYS video. If you've got further questions, please ask them below or send us an email via the contact forms on our website. Happy to donate my time to share information with you. You can support us in keeping this channel ad free by purchasing some merchandise on our store or by making a donation on PayPal. And don't forget to subscribe. Thanks again for watching.